Hello everyone and welcome back to Digimon Story Cyber Sleuth Hacker's Memory. I actually decided to leave the game on for a couple of hours. As you'll see here, we were at like 220 hours last time. Now we're at 229, probably. Yep, 229 in two minutes. The reason I did that is to let the farm Digimon move ahead a good bit. Sorry, something in my throat. So we're going to go and check them out and see how they progress. I looked at Alphamon and I made a mistake. I did not realize his intelligence being how high it is that he would not have very much space for attack gain at all. So while Durandamon and Begidramon and Armageddon all got a very nice boost, uh, Alphamon got a little screwed over. Just a tad. But we'll fix it. We'll make it better. It's no big deal. What I really want to look at is all these nerds. Also, someone told me that you buy the restraint chips in Eden Entrance and you can get better ones as you get further in the game. So we will be going and buying a lot of high-level restraint chips very soon. Uh, the NXs I don't care about. Volcanomon still has to get to level 50. He is at 46. So that's four levels away, but he does have to get 135 defense. He is not quite there. He's got 18 to go, but we can change him to a defender type. He'll probably still have to overlevel a little bit, unless I want to make him go through a training thing, but I'll probably just overlevel him. All we need... This is my Gryphonmon, not my Varadoramon. All we need is for Hippogryphmon here to get up five more levels, and we've got Gryphonmon down. Megadramon is our Goldramon. He's got to get up 11 more levels and get a lot more intelligence. We need to change him to an intelligence type. Probably going to have to put him through some training because he's a good ways away, but that shouldn't be too hard to fix. Kendogarurumon. Camaraderie can be fixed whenever I feel like it. Eight more levels and a lot of speed. Going to have to fix his speed probably with the training session as well. XVmon, can you... You can't Digivolve! You're one attack point away! 841 experience. Hey, you know what? Actually, you know what I'm going to do? Because getting to Gallantmon Crimson mode, which is what this XVmon is doing, is really important. I will actually use one of the Braypoint E's I got from doing those, uh... I got that from doing the... What are they called? Domination battles. I did some domination battles off screen. So, because I just wanted them out of the... out of the way. Is this... yeah, this is your farm island. Alright, so let's Digivolve XVmon really quickly into Rise Greymon. There you have it, 39 Abby, doing well. I assume he'll need... I know he needs 80 Abby to become Gallimon. I assume he'll need 100 Abby to become Gallimon Crimson Mode, so I will level him up further and then degenerate him. We gotta take him down. I'll let him level up a bit, and then I'll degenerate him rather than doing it immediately. We gotta go down Geo Greymon's line to all the way down to Koromon, and then Koromon can become Geomon, and then Growlmon, and then War Growlmon, then Gallimon, and then Gallimon Crimson Mode from there. That is the plan that we're gonna go with. I also looked at this Ice Mon earlier, and I didn't realize uh, he has, like, no Abby, so his level is maxed to 25. He can't level up any further, so we may as well degenerate him. There you go. A Goonimon can Digivolve back into Burning Greymon, so let's get that. There he is, my boy. And he has 22 Abby now, so he is able to go to Kaiser Greymon, or Emperor Greymon, whatever translation you want to go with. Which is very good. 1500 HP, 150 attack, 120 defense. You should hit all of those by the time you get up to level 55. Probably. I doubt we'll need to mess with you any. Pandamon! This is the Edamon Pandamon, but he is 7 speed points short. I'm actually going to change you to a speed type right now, and I don't think that's going to give you enough, but it'll get you very close. You won't be far off. Yeah, 97. So he's just got to get up to level 48, and I'd rather just wait for him to get up the extra levels than try and do anything fancy. So we'll just wait on that. This Hippogryphomon is our Varadoramon, and he's actually met all requirements. He just has to get up 15 more levels, so that'll happen when it does. Bow Huckmon has overleveled a little bit. He can become Savior Huckmon now. I think that's what this ultimate form is called. We'll see in just a second. Look at that. Pretty awesome. Good lead up to Jessmon. Really fits. It is Savior Huckmon. Thought so. Trident Saber. I like it. Increases attack by 50% when HP drops below 10%. That's pretty good. Alright, and I don't care about getting Jessmon again because I've already got Jessmon in the field guide because I got him in the first game. So now, I am still going to let you level up and then degenerate. Because I think... Uh, wait a minute, can I check and see how much Abby Shoutmon needs to become Omni Shoutmon? I've gotten Shoutmon before, haven't I? I just haven't gotten Omni Shoutmon? No, I don't think I have Shoutmon either. 
I might just be blind. I don't see Shoutmon anywhere. There should be two... If I don't have Shoutmon, there should be two rookies missing. There should be... Shoutmon is missing and Arcadimon rookie. There's only one rookie missing. Hold up. Something doesn't add up here. Am I blind? Where is Shoutmon? Am I actually losing my mind? Is he listed at the end? Yeah, he is right there. Shoutmon. Okay. He was listed at the end. The game confused me. Oh, it doesn't show me the stuff you need, though. So I don't know how much Abby he actually needs. I'm gonna assume he needs 80 like a Royal Knight would. And he's almost at like 40, so that's not too bad. Yeah, he's at 31. I actually thought it was at like 39 or something, but that's that's still decent. We'll level him up a bit before we start degenerating him back down. But th that is the plan, is for the Savior Huckmon to become my Omni Shoutmon. Uh, Dragomon can degenerate nice Devamon. Now he has 19 Abby, so once he digivolves back into Dragomon, he can go from Dragomon to Neptunemon. And that will work out well. You, I think, are one of the ones who is going to become my two Machine Dramon. Andromon cannot become Machine Dramon, good to know. I don't remember what can digivolve into Machine Dramon, but I think I can check with the field guide. Need to go to Machine Dramon. We have so many Megas to get. Holy cow. It's a nightmare. Where's Machine Dramon in this list? Right there. Oh, no, I accidentally clicked on Mirage Galgamon. All right. Giga Dramon, Datamon, or Mega Dramon. Okay. And then he has Apoclymon and Chaos Dramon as his two further beyond levels. I don't know if they count as Ultra or what. Probably do. So I just need to get... Okay. Seems easy enough. Those are my options. Who else do we need to look at before I go from this? Wisemon probably needs to degenerate. Yeah, you could degenerate just for more Abby, so you can become Wizardmon, I guess. Yeah, most of these Digimon now, I'm just trying to get more Abby on them in case I can ever use them in the future. I think I was going to try and make you into one of the Sistermon, but I don't really remember. I probably shouldn't have degenerated you. I should have gotten you to Ultimate, but too little too late, I suppose. We do have to get 50 Abby and a ton of stats on the Sistermon. Oh my goodness, that's going to be horrible. It's going to be, like, really difficult to pull off. I don't like it. Uh, you can Digivolve into Ultimate, so may as well. You could actually have gone into Datamon and you could become one of the Machine Dramon, but whatever. I have a feeling that what's going to end up happening is I'm going to have like five or six Digimon all trying to become a Machine Dramon, and just whoever gets there first gets it. Uh, I can Digivolve you into Pandamon because you need more EXP, or not EXP, you need more Abby. So I need to remember this 34 Abby Pandamon is one of the Sistermon. And it's almost got enough Abby, thankfully. Over here... What is this Hippogriffamon doing? Doesn't even have enough Abby to become any of them, so I guess it needs to degenerate into Unimon, because why not? There you go, Unimon. Easy. Whatever. Just gaining Abby, basically. You can become a Cyberdramon, because why not? 25 Abby, pretty good. Alright then. You're supposed to be... Are you my Boncho Leomon? think this is my Boncho Leomon? Maybe? It can Digivolve into it now. It should get enough attack and defense by level 55. Okay, we'll see how that goes. You can degenerate into, like, whatever, basically. Turaimon, whatever. Doesn't matter. Just getting you Abby at this point. This Mott Galgamon is supposed to become our Marukimon, but it needs more Abby. 15. That's a little bit. You know what? Just do this. Degenerate into Galmon. 18 Abby. Now you go straight from Galmon to Marukimon. So Galgamon, Mot Galgamon, Marukimon. Straight up from there. You're not doing anything anymore? Yeah. Whoops. So again, you're just a Digimon that should degenerate for Abby. Which is what a lot of these Digimon have been regulated to. Uh, Gargamon, why not? I've got a lot of Digimon with over 20 Abby, at least. Hey, you can become Hisyariumon. Why not? 
There you go. What a good Digimon. Maimamon can degenerate into Tyranomon because Tyranomon can degenerate into Maimamon for some reason that I don't understand. This Chromon can degenerate into Pekmon. There we go. Tons of degeneration. Degeneration for everyone. Okay, now... What I want to do, the first thing we're going to do now that I've spent 10 minutes doing all of that, which I knew that would take a while, but, you know, it is what it is. Where are we supposed to go for the main story? We're supposed to go to Erica's memory server, right? We're not going to do that just yet. We'll probably do it today, but I want to go to the Metropolitan Building first, because we should be able to go deeper into it now. There's Victor Uchida. May as well talk to him every time I see him, I guess. Do I don't want to read that. Okay, sure. Whatever. I don't understand that guy. I don't really want to, to be honest with you. So let's go to the Metropolitan Office. And you know what? In hindsight, I should have done this slightly different. But let's, uh... I'll let Digimon attack me for now. I want to go to this floor, I think? I want to go down... Turn on high security for just a second. I want to go back into Eden really quickly and buy the restraint chips and use them on Alphamon or Yukin and then set them to train again. That's what I meant to do before coming here, but I wasn't thinking straight. Oh no, this only takes you into the DigiLive. It doesn't let you go into Eden. Rip. I thought it would also let me into Eden. Well, never mind then. We'll have to deal with that later, I suppose. I'll leave high security off, but acceleration is a must-have. And we'll run Tyrant Kabuterimon, Slayerjimon, and Dianamon for now. Oh no! I'm not Galgamon and I can in Bimon. However, will I overcome this combination? Nice and damage up. I think I have a lot of combo up things on Dianamon, don't I? She gets combos like really easily, if I remember correctly. How did you... First of all, how did you let the Mock Galgamon live? Second of all, how did you miss the Cannon Beamon? There are, like, so many questions to be answered here. Goodbye. Danamon, if you wouldn't mind taking out the trash, would be much appreciated. I guess you can have Slayer Jamon help you out. Goodbye. Well done, team. Well done. Level 82 for Dianamon. Not bad. Alright, so now can I use this... The elevator is still broken. Have I been lied to? I thought they said... Maybe the comments were just mistaken. I thought that I was able to check the rest of the floors now, but I guess not. Okay, can I go down this way? By going back here? Okay, I can go down to the 39th floor. Have I already gone through here? No, there are item boxes. Alright, so we can go through this way. It's just that one elevator doesn't work, I guess, for some weird reason. Skull Mar not Skull Marimon, Blue Marimon. Yeah, that's what I meant to say. Blue Marimon and a Skull Greymon, huh? Look at how much Dianamon does in damage to something that resists her. I love having the intelligence boosts and whatnot. Get shined on by the bee, you nerds. Goodbye. It's honestly too easy. Nothing can take the shine of the bee. I do not have the... Whatchamacallit's it's on you guys, do I? The Tactician USBs. Who has them, though? You do. I will put them on you instead. That's pretty good. You know what? I'll put that on Slayer Jermon. He's got an open space. More items drop, the better, I guess. Holy cow. Where do I... 38th floor first, I guess. Like, where to even begin with that one? There's an item right here, which is pretty good. And then instead of jumping down here, I'm going to go back up here and check this elevator's other locations. I forgot that Vodimon existed, I'm not going to lie, and I'm disgusted to remember that it does exist. It is one ugly Digimon. Get shined on by the bee, you nerds. It's honestly too easy. Tyrant Kabuterimon is unstoppable. Very nice experience. Much better once you have the Tactician USBs back on. 
I am here now. Got an item box up here. Bug recovery. Meh. Oh my word. I forgot how confusing the Metropolitan Building can be. We're gonna be here for a little while. Just a little while. That did nothing. Holy cow. I was expecting... Was that a... Is Thunderfall a magic attack? Did way less than I thought it would. Goodbye. Not the Metal Meteor. Oh, the damage. Get out of here. Chain attack might actually be necessary. Honestly, even with the chain attack, it might live. Yep, there it is. Lived after the chain attack. Be gone. What part of be gone does this guy not understand? Get out of here. Very good. We're finally getting to the point in the game where I don't get, like, three level ups every fight. Look at you. No, it's a physical attack. I mean, it's pretty weak, but I didn't think you'd do that little. 326 attack. That's weird. Do you have any better moves? A bunch of magic moves, which sucks. I have Crescent Leaf 3, so I don't need to put Crescent Leaf 2 on. Well, that's a little lame, but whatever. Honestly, Shine of B is so good, it doesn't really matter that much. Thankfully, this does kind of dead end here. Emerald, that's good money. I might turn off the random encounters. And by that, I mean use high security, obviously. I might use high security relatively soon. Because we're not getting great experience out of these guys. I mean, we're not getting horrible experience, but it's not fantastic. And we're not really in dire need of level ups right now. Ooh, I do like seeing a room that is just a couple item boxes. Still have not found a single memory up, though. But yeah, I might turn off encounters soon and just focus on getting through here and getting all the items. I will take this, thank you. HP Capsule A. Oh no! Vodimon and Skull Greymon. They proved such formidable opponents the first time that we defeated them. I'm sure this time will be no different. That does like nothing. Huh, I wonder why that is. I think a Gale Storm is even gonna kill one of them. I killed the Vodimon. So I'd say it was worth it. Not the Oblivion Bird! That wasn't a bird at all. Die, you stupid Skull Greymon, die. Be gone from this place. My normal attacks were too much for him. Yeah, the experiment. The words. The experience is good enough. I almost said the experiments are good enough. That wouldn't have made any sense. 38. So many floors to go to, so little time to go to them all. Gimme, gimme. Intelligence Restraint Chip is really useful because I'll be using that on Alphamon or Yukon. Ocean Wave, go! Look at that damage that I didn't do to the Door Greymon because of Dodge. Because you dodged, I'm now going to have to use Shine and B to make up for it. There you have it. So, Jermon, if you could just take out the trash here, buddy. Thank you. 6,792. I love it. Where haven't I gone on this elevator? 39th floor? Is there anything over here? Yep, a single item box. I'm gonna run from this one. We don't have to fight every single time we run into combat. Best meet two. Eh. Not great, not horrible. Okay, uh, was it the 38th floor that had another pathway we could have taken? The downwards path, I believe? Yeah, it does. Okay. I need them to stop having all floor <laughs> all four floors as an option. I mean, it does lead to more item boxes, I guess, but it's a lot to go through. Thank you for actually hitting this time, Dianamon. Meteor fall. Why? Why? Why do I keep missing that guy? Okay, now I'm just a little upset. 
that that didn't kill. Whatever. They're just normal attacking for some reason. Do one of them have an ability that lets them recover SP? Probably Waymon. I think Waymon has an ability like that. His support skill or whatever it is. I don't remember. Alright, I need these two item boxes. Friendship. Eh. Again. You know what? I'm going to kill these two fools and then I'm going to turn off the counters. Let's just try and get through the Metropolitan Building. That way we can get to work on fixing Erica's memories. Goodbye. Too easy.